Hello, dear students. Welcome in the study of chemistry. Uh, the name of channel is Chemistry in Engineering, and here the topics related to engineering chemistry are studied. So this is Dr. Jyoti Shegokar. You watch the video until the end and uh, get the knowledge which is related to the engineering chemistry. All the topics as per the NEP 2020 are covered in this particular video. So guys, if you like these videos, like all the videos, share it to your friends, and subscribe the channel if not already. And if you are a new one for this channel so definitely subscribe and also hit the bell button so that you will get the videos as soon as they are uploaded okay so uh, today we will study photovoltaic cell photovoltaic cell photo and volt so when there is a use of photo that is light and formation of the energy which is an electrical energy it is done by the particular device which is called as a photovoltaic cell it is also called as a solar cell yes the cell or the panel which is present in uh, in the on the roof of your home on the roof of the different buildings complexes hospitals farms the all uh, the panels which you can see that panels are nothing but the arrangements or the different modules of solar cells that is photovoltaic cells firstly they are present in the series and they are connected with the parallels and formation of a large panels which can get a lot of energy from the sun and convert it into a highly uh, importantly which is required that is electrical energy so as it is a source of renewable energy or it is a non-conventional energy it is a very much useful in this particular age as because the fossil fuels are uh, continuously diminishing the formation or the requirement of the uh, renewable energy sources is increasing and this is one of the very important step towards uplifting the value of the uh, solar or the renewable energy type of sources okay so here uh, the particular cell its construction its working will be studied with the applications also okay so first of all you can see here a very cute diagram which already drawn by me you can see here there is a presence of a p n type silicon p type silicon then anti reflecting coating is given then a nickel plating electrodes you can see and load okay now these are red colored dots which are already there they are nothing but electrons while the holes are seen just like a hole by the black so this is the diagram of the photovoltaic cell now what is its construction firstly its principle is that it converts the electrical energy uh, requirement it converts the solar energy directly into electrical energy which can be used for the lot of purposes wherever it is required e-bikes vehicles wherever it is required it can convert the solar uh, it can convert the solar energy or the photons into the electrical energy uh, so here you can see that this diagram as it is having n type of silicon so silicon it is i already wrote silicon but it is a semiconductor instead of silicon number of options may be there like some organic photovoltaics like uh, some uh, cadmium telluride type of material can be used but silicon is more favorable for this particular process silicon it is abundantly found as from the silica number of processes are done on the silica in presence of carbon formation of a, a material which is a very precious and it on that material number of processes in presence of hydrogen are done and formation of a, uh, silicon is there which is used for the uh, production of energy in this photovoltaic cell okay so these uh, semiconductors are used there now semiconductors as you know that these are not directly used but these are injected by some material what type of uh, we need the what type of ions on that basis the material is injected and this process is called as a doping doping is nothing but the injection of the some impurities we can say or the material what type we require as because silicon though it is a uh, um, having the electrons but they, they are in the bias 
बाइंड और बाउंडेड कंडीशन सो इफ द सम मटेरियल इज इंजेक्टेड इट विल जस्ट एक्साइट एंड मूव टूवर्ड्स इट्स रिस्पेक्टिव इलेक्ट्रोड सो सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल दिस पी टाइप ऑफ सेमी कंडक्टर इट विल बी डोप्ड बाय द मटेरियल लाइक बोरॉन वाइल दिस एन टाइप ऑफ सेमी कंडक्टर कैन बी डोप्ड बाय द सम मटेरियल लाइक सम मेटल ऑक्साइड्स और सम प्लेटिनम और सम फॉस्फरस टाइप ऑफ मटेरियल सो दैट इट विल फॉर्म द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इट विल हैव द मोर इलेक्ट्रॉन्स फॉर द फॉर द एक्साइटमेंट और फॉर द रिक्वायरमेंट ड्यूरिंग इट्स वर्किंग और मैकेनिज्म सो हियर in this way that material is used just consider that the, here there is a presence of uh, we will see its vertical view for our sake of convenience if there is a material one of the material from the p type is presence of holes at first you can see here and from the n type there is a presence of electrons so as soon as it will come in contact with each other means as it is connected with each other you can see here there is a one line which is produced this is not a single line but there is a presence of such type of a uh, construction so as soon as they will come in contact with each other as they are negatively charged electrons are attracted by these holes these electrons get in between in uh, within or beneath the uh, that holes electrons will be produced so holes will be totally occupied by the electrons there is no totally electrons or no totally uh, these holes are found but that holes which are there they are with electrons so in this way there is a formation of a junction it's called as a pn junction and this area is called as a depletion area because in this this electrons which are there which are beneath the that uh, holes present now after this this is the uh, stable or the starting initial condition but when as soon as the sunlight for Also on this p-n junction. Here you can see the arrows that they are. I'm drawing these arrows. They are nothing but the solar photons or the solar rays which are falling on this particular diode. So here, as soon as these photons are uh, falled, so as the material which we have already used, like uh, the phosphorus or boron, that material is uh, showing its particular band gap. So that band gap must be of 1.5 electron volt. so that it will be beneficial for the electrons to get excited from the lower to the uh, upper orbital or the um, upper uh, level so in this way the material is used now the, it is connected with this positive and negative electrode you can see that electrodes are nothing but the um, uh, some plated material here like you can see nickel plated positive uh, or the uh, anode which is uh, there so and this one is a cathode which is uh, attached to the holes type of section or p type of semiconductor so uh, as soon as the energy is falled on this particular diode what will happen the uh, photons are there which uh, excites the excites that electrons from the holes so electrons will totally moved from the holes and they will move toward their respective electrode so these electrons will be moved towards positively charged electrodes and holes will move towards negatively charged electrodes but according to the uh, electrode or uh, when once it is uh, there towards its electrode the electron will flow into the external circuit when the electrons will flow to the external circuit the opposing from the opposing side the current will flow in this uh, and uh, we will we'll get the energy as a energy which is as a electricity as there is a presence of electron in this way there is a creation of a battery total battery is produced here and that battery is totally depending on the solar energy in this way the photovoltaic cell produces the energy number of electrons produces number of uh, or the uh, quantity of current or the electricity will be produced a single cell can produce 0.5 to 0.6 volt of energy which is not very much uh, or not very high extent but uh, and that's why there is no use of directly the um, uh, single cell but there is a use of 
number of uh, cells connected with each other as a panel or as a module so in this way the uh, lot of electrons will be produced number of electrons produced will be number of will show the uh, higher amount of um, electrons and higher amount of energy will be produced so in this way as you can see here the anti reflecting coating it is nothing but the coating of glass the wafers uh, wafers like material of silicon is produced uh, is uh, present which is uh, coated by the glass which is a reflecting material so that it will be uh, protected from the different environmental uh, things like wind or other things uh, so in this way there is a construction of photovoltaic cell and uh, working of photovoltaic cell you might have understood guys the construction and working if you have any question you can ask me in the comments and uh, i will definitely answer it so uh in this way there is a working uh now the different type of applications where it is used actually there is no need to say because uh, everywhere there may be the use of the renewable energy sources like from the uh, e bikes there is a use of particular batteries may be h2o2 fuel cell that hydrogen which is produced hydrogen which is available in the water water is split to form the hydrogen that is just one of the example and that hydrogen can be produced by the photovoltaic cell with a with a um, presence of photovoltaic cell and electrochemical reactions occurs and there is a formation of the hydrogen lot of hydrogen will be produced and that hydrogen is essentially uh, there for the uh, for, uh, for uh, the applications or use in the uh, e bikes or e vehicles trucks trains travels wherever it is required it is there and can be directly used in the same way it is used in the hospitals uh, in the different farms there you might have seen the number of panels so uh, everywhere this energy can be used from the small calculator you might have heard the word of solar calculators up to the large energy uh, requirement that is uh, can be stored for the generator purpose for the inverter purpose so in this way today we have seen the study we have studied the photovoltaic cell i hope guys you might uh, understood or uh, you must understood these topics Uh, so here we will uh, stop uh, and uh, if once again i am requesting you to uh, like share and subscribe the channel thank you thank you once again